these samples came out really nice but you're gonna have to redo this one because you guys have like some type of a drip stain there you got like a little dent thing going on here and i don't know what happened with that line there redo or touch up welcome to forensic colors touch up anima mundi class So when you have a two-tone Anima Mundi, you're going to want to, or a two-tone anything, you're going to want to touch up with both of the colors that you used. And the nice thing about Anima Mundi is it blends into itself very, very well. So you can take both of these tones and kind of put them right over your trouble areas. As long as those areas have been leveled off first. So if you have a really deep scratch or hole, you'll want to fill in with joint compound or spackling or something first. Let that dry and then come in with the product and touch it up and blend it right in just like that. And we'll use the un untinted Anamundi which was used on this sample as well as the other color which is called B8. Not to be confused with BB8. And they just blend right into themselves just like when we did the original sample. And it's very easy to touch up. And you can play back and forth until you get it looking exactly how you want it. And if this was one color, it'd be even more simple because you're just playing with the same color going over your trouble areas and blending it in with the flat of the trowel. And just like new.